G'day folks, it's Lauren from Snowies here with the Austrail Outback Comforter Queen Sleeping Bag. It. It's an all-in-one design with a built-in balance. It's got a durable outer, a soft, cozy inner, and will fit most Queen camping-sized mattresses. So your sleeping bag will come uh, all packed up like this with the dimensions of around about 50 centimetres long by 40 centimetres square. There is this uh, webbing strap here that will click over the top and you can pull it really tight to try and sort of compress it down to as small as you can get it. And it's also got this additional uh, webbing strap here so you can carry it over your shoulder. It weighs around about four and a half kilos. So external um, materials we have here is a, a really durable outer cotton, um, Austral call it a, a soft cotton. On the inside we have a flannelette cotton liner um, which is Austral's own uh, flannel tech fabric. On the inside between these two layers here we have 150 GSMs of a hollow fibre synthetic fill. Um, that is also the same on, on the back side here. So you have two times 150 uh, GSM layers. Now as you can see on the outside here the quilting pattern we've got is a diamond shape whilst on the inside we've got more um, a series of straight lines and swerves. The reason why Austral have done this a difference in the quilting on the outside and the inside is to prevent any cold spots uh, leaking through with the stitch lines running through the insulation. So talking about the insulation, the Outback Comforter has a comfort temperature rating of zero degrees, a uh, lower limit of around about minus five. You'd ideally probably not want to be using this bag in that sort of zero to mi minus five temperature. It's probably going to be a good autumn, possibly summer, uh, sorry, spring bag. Um, um, if you're wanting to use it closer to those zero degree temperatures, you'd probably benefit from having an extra blanket on the top or something like that. Our uh, measurements when we're set up is 200 meters, centimeters sorry, long and about 152 centimeters wide. So we've got a couple of features on the bag. The first one being down the end here, as you can see, we have this extra panel of um, gray fabric that essentially creates a 3D foot box construction here when you're in it, gives you enough room for your feet and means you're not sort of pulling the blanket to try and account for that extra space down there. The zip system that we've got is actually just one single U-shaped zip. So there's not a separate uh, foot zip or side zip. Um, it has, as you can see here, the little black webbing on the inside of the zip here is a nice little anti-snag feature to stop the fabric getting chewed up by the zip. And as we zip it along, come up to the top here, the zip itself also has a, a, a locking feature, so it's not, you can't uh, accidentally pull that zip open. It sort of keeps itself into place here as well. And then up at the top here, we've got these Velcro tabs. So if you do want to adjust the zip whilst you're inside of it to get a bit of ventilation on the sides, you can just pop this zip, uh, this uh, Velcro tab over and that will help keep the two layers together for you. As you can see here, we've got this sort of shiny grey fabric on this end and also down here on this end. This is actually the Valance pocket. So we'll tip up the mattress for you so you can see how it's anchored to the mattress underneath. So on the foot end, we've got a nice big long sleeve. That's obviously the side that you're gonna wanna be putting onto the mattress first. And then on the other end here, we have these two corner pockets which will what you'll be doing um, second and third. So in terms of the care instructions one of the most common questions that we get for sleeping bags and especially double sleeping bags is a is it machine washable? No it's not it's hand washable so it's probably going to be handy to use this in conjunction with a liner and the second most common double uh, sleeping bag question we get is whether or not you could use the two halves to make two single sleeping bags and no you can't it's got a single zip so it only has one zip slider you would be able to remove the top half if you wanted to use that as a separate blanket but the underside will just need to stay as it is so that's about it for the Austral outback comforter queen sized sleeping bag you can get it at snowies.com.au at our lowest prices every day if you found this video helpful give us a like if you've got any questions or comments chuck them below you can head here to subscribe or hear for more helpful videos catch latest noise fans